Becker Underwood's Vault HP Plus Integral for Soybeans offers soybean producers the opportunity to realize bigger yields and greater returns from their soybean seed investment. In fact, independent field trials have shown an average yield improvement over multiple states, locations, and growing conditions of as much as four bushels per acre. That's the average, and across all locations, applying Vault HP has delivered a positive return on investment more than 70% of the time, and a five to one return on investment 50% of the time, according to multiple years of yield trials. Offering this high quality, seed applied inoculant is just one more way we're helping you better serve your producer customers. So what exactly is Vault HP Plus Integral and what role can it play in helping boost soybean yields? Vault HP Plus Integral is a soybean performance boosting system. It includes advanced nitrogen fixing rhizobia, a performance booster that enhances the activity of the rhizobia and extends on-seed survival, and an EPA registered biological fungicide. In this first of three videos, we'll focus on the rhizobia portion of the Vault HP system. Millions of living organisms live in every cubic centimeter of soil found in a typical farm field. Some of these organisms, if not controlled, can cause disease. Others help break down decaying plant material, releasing nutrients back into the soil for future crops to use. Still others have developed mutually beneficial relationships with the crops grown in the field, such as the case with the soybean plant and the bacteria Bradyrhizobium japonicum. We'll just call them rhizobia. After planting, as the soybean seeds begin to sprout, they release certain chemical compounds. If rhizobia are near the seed, either because they were already in the soil or because a rhizobia inoculant had been applied to the seed, the rhizobia are alerted by those chemical compounds that a soybean seed is nearby. In response, the rhizobia excrete their own chemical messages. These messages are picked up by specific receptors on the growing root shoots of the soybean plant. Very quickly, plant root hairs near the rhizobia begin to flatten and curl. A pocket is formed by the root hair, and when rhizobia are captured in this pocket, the process of nodulation begins. While this process is extremely complex, we know that the rhizobia actually penetrates the root hair membrane. An invasion thread is formed that grows down through the root hair and eventually enters the plant root cortex, the tissue layer found immediately below the epidermis, which is the outer layer of the root surface. As the invasion thread grows near, cortex cells are stimulated to rapidly divide, and it is in this area where the invasion thread ultimately enters a single cell. The rhizobia moves into the co-opted cell, and a symbiotic, mutually beneficial relationship is established. A distinctive nodule begins to form as these cells divide. The rhizobia receive nutrition from the plant. In turn, they produce nitrogen in a form used by the soybean plant for growth and grain production from the nitrogen in the air. So why the need to inoculate? Don't the rhizobia survive beyond a single season? And why Vault HP from Becker Underwood? Clearly, some of the rhizobia do survive in the soil for months, even years. However, these surviving rhizobia will have self-selected for their ability to survive adverse conditions, not for their cell incursion and ability to fix the most nitrogen. So these rhizobia that manage to survive under the hostile conditions in the soil are not as efficient as the high numbers of specially selected rhizobia included in the Vault HP formulation. As noted earlier, we'll talk in greater detail about the total Vault HP plus integral inoculant system in the next segment. But for now, let's talk about six important things you need to know and remember about all rhizobia inoculants, especially when handling an inoculant or comparing different inoculant products. One, you need to always remember that rhizobia are living organisms. They must have oxygen to survive. That's why the rhizobia in Vault HP are packaged and stored the way they are. Two, because rhizobia are living creatures, they need a food source particularly after the rhizobia have been placed on the seed and before the seed is planted. During this period of reduced activity, they still need nutrition, like that included in the Vault HP Growth Enhancer. This food source is especially important if the seed isn't planted for some time after the inoculant is placed on the seed. 
Three, rhizobia can't tolerate extreme temperatures. Avoid allowing liquid inoculant to freeze before it's applied to seed. Avoid applying inoculant to frozen seed. Avoid leaving a case of inoculant in a closed vehicle on a warm day. Avoid exposing bags, boxes, or seed tenders to extended periods of sunlight on warm spring days. All of these conditions can cause a rapid decline in the number of live rhizobia available to deliver proper nodulation once the seed is planted. However, research tests show once the rhizobia are on the seed and the treatment has dried, then keeping the seed at or near freezing can actually help improve on-seed survival over time. 4. Remember that exposure to ultraviolet light will also kill rhizobia. That's another reason why you never want to leave a seed tender completely uncovered and exposed to sunlight for an extended period of time. 5. Remember that rhizobia are particularly sensitive to heavy metals like molybdenum, zinc, iron, and other metals that may be included in micronutrient packages. While the actual amount of product applied per acre may be very low, the concentration of these metals on the seed in close proximity to the rhizobia in a high moisture environment makes this a deadly situation for the rhizobia. Six, finally, remember that all chemical seed treatment products are not the same. While the active ingredient may be the same for two different products, those products may have a vastly different effect on rhizobia and possibly other microbial plant health products. In other words, the inert ingredients can sometimes be not so inert when it comes to their effect on organisms such as living rhizobia. That's why Vault HP is carefully tested with a broad range of reputable seed treatment products and why you can be assured that the Vault HP system will work with these products as reported. In the next video, we'll talk specifically about the other parts of the Vault HP Plus Integral System, the unique patented inoculant formulation, why the product is packaged as it is, the role of the Performance Boosting Enhancer Pack, and the role of the Integral Biological Fungicide in helping deliver better performance and higher soybean yields.